Hello viewers, this is Gaston from the Healthcare Engineering team. I am happy to release another video under Biomedical Engineering concept. You guys know about Biomedical Engineering. We have heard a lot of times about Biomedical Engineering. There are so many biomedical engineers all around the world working in different sectors like hospitals, companies, research fields and many more. Do you know that biomedical engineering is an umbrella term which means there are so many specialties inside it. We can do so many specialization inside the biomedical engineering concept. In this video, I am going to talk about such specializations individually. So if you are a biomedical engineer and if you would like to work in such a specialized area, you can get the idea whatever you would like to prefer to do in future. Personally, I can give you an idea that I am very interested in clinical engineering, which comes under biomedical engineering. So I work as a clinical engineer. Likewise, there are so many specializations. If you would like to pursue your career in any one of these specializations, you can get the idea from our videos and you can go on in future. We would like to release this video part wise, part 1 as well as part 2. This is our part 1. Continuously we will release the part 2. We request from the viewers to give your support by subscribe and share our channel with your colleagues in the healthcare industry so that we can provide you many more informative videos like this in future. Without further ado, let's get into the video. Okay, before get into the topic, I would like to request you all to subscribe our YouTube channel Healthcare Engineering to give your support. Branches in Biomedical Engineering Biomedical Engineering is technically the application of engineering principles to the fields of biology and healthcare. What this means is that biomedical engineers apply their knowledge, design and development of healthcare technology, materials and processes. In some cases, biomedical engineering not only enhances quality of life but also saves lives. As a multidisciplinary field, biomedical engineering covers many different areas of medicine, engineering, computer technology and many more, which make a number of specialities possible even some that may be still in development as the biomedical engineering fields evolve. There are many types of biomedical engineering specializations to explore. Such most common areas are discussed here. Before explaining the concept, I would like to advertise our support to the healthcare business. We can advertise the healthcare products, we can promote your healthcare events, we provide supports to boost up your healthcare business, we provide technical reviews for your medical device and many more online supports you can get from our platforms. If you would like to get the supports from us, please contact us to the given email address so that we can support you in knowledge wise as well as business wise. We are also very active in these shown social media platforms. We would like to welcome you all to follow us in any of these platforms in or in all of these platforms to get our updates. If you would like to publish any of your findings or your knowledge, please utilize our platform. All these platforms links are given in the description below. Let's get into the topic. First specialization is bioinformatics. It is an interdisciplinary field that develops methods and software tools for understanding biological data. As an interdisciplinary field of science, bioinformatics combines computer science, statistics, mathematics and engineering to analyze and interpret biological data. Next specialization is biomechanics. 
It is the study of the structure and function of the mechanical aspects of biological systems at any level from whole organisms to organs, cells and cell organelles using the methods of mechanics. Engineers who specialize in biomechanics focus on designing and developing products that aid with motion within the body. Artificial heart valves and joint replacements are some examples of biomechanical products that assist with the flow of blood and motor functions, respectively, which can extend people's lives and make them more functional and less painful. The next specialization is biomaterials. This is the use of both living tissues and artificial materials for the purpose of implantation. It is any matter, surface or construct that interacts with the living systems. The study of biomaterials is called biomaterials science or biomaterials engineering. It has experienced steady and strong growth over its history with many companies investing large amounts of money into the development of new products. Biomaterial science encompasses elements of medicine, biology, chemistry, tissue engineering and materials science. Biomaterials professionals are tasked with designing and developing materials that are suitable for use within the human body. These implant materials must be completely safe for patients and that means the absence of carcinogenic properties and toxins. Implant materials also need to be structurally sound so that they can last a lifetime and chemically stable and inert. Some biomaterials make use of living cells for better assimilation into the body. In medicine today, all kinds of implants are being used to improve functionality and provide new treatments for several conditions, including supports for tissues regeneration and nanoparticles that can detect cancers. Biomaterials need to be tested extensively for safety and longevity after they are developed and before they can be used in the human body. Next specialization is biomedical instrumentation. Bioinstrumentation or biomedical instrumentation is an application of biomedical engineering which focuses on the device and mechanics used to measure, evaluate and treat biological systems. It focuses on the use of multiple sensors to monitor physiological characteristics of a human or animal. Biosignal Processing This field monitors, measures and interprets the signals which the human body gives off. Biological signals or biosignals are space, time or space-time records for biological events such as a beating heart or a contracting muscle. Biosignals are electrical and non-electrical body signals. Electrical, chemical and mechanical activity that occurs during this biological event often produces signals that can be measured and analyzed. Biosignals therefore contain useful information that can be used to understand the underlying physiological mechanisms of a specific biological event or system and that may be useful for medical diagnosis. The next specialization is Biomedical Optics. This field refers to the interaction of biological tissue and light and how this can be exploited for sensing, imaging and treatment. Next very common specialization in Biomedical Engineering is Tissue Engineering. Tissue engineering is literally the creation of tissues and tissue materials to replace failing body functions. One of the goals of tissue engineering is to create artificial organs via biological materials for patients that need organ transplants. 
Biomedical engineers are currently researching methods of creating such organs. Researchers have grown solid jaw bones and tracheas from human stem cells towards this end. Several artificial urinary bladders have been grown in laboratories and transplanted successfully into human patients. Bioartificial organs which use both synthetic and biological components are also a focus area in research such as with hepatic assist devices that use liver cells within an artificial bioreactor construct.